Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises to Yahweh and his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh is the name of the one true God, and Yahweh Shai is the name of his only begotten son, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus. And I want to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And I want to send salutations to all the Akim throughout the four corners of the earth, exalting the name of Yahweh and his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, in truth and in sincerity. All right, so this lesson is going to be about basically the, the mind frame of these people when, when things get serious or when there's a... a when danger is presented to them overall, uh, we remember what happened when the pandemic started. <coughs> um, people went crazy and started buying toilet paper, which I still don't understand why they did that. <laughs> but they did. They did that. Now, right now, there was a cyber attack. All right. Um, you know, on uh, on the gas um right now and uh there's a gas shortage right now for um from this cyber attack okay and uh right now in certain parts of the world there are gas shortages all right and you see the 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 reaction of people and things that they're doing that they're not being rational with their decision making, okay? All right, I get it. You know, hey, if you need gas, get gas then. But there's a certain way you'd go about it. And these people are doing some of the stupidest shit right now. I mean, motherfuckers getting, getting grocery bags, trying to fill it up with gas, and then putting it in their car, okay? In the trunk of their car, in the backseat of their car. <clears throat> all right it's uh it's madness all right um it's madness all right and, and it's crazy because it's only happening in certain parts of america but you know there like you just tell by the way people react to things man that when things truly crack off man when the lord uh pour out those those angels pour out those bowls man and when the Lord allows all hell to break loose, man, these people are not going to be ready. They're not going to be prepared in no way, physically, mentally at all. And, you know, I just want to show this a couple couple clips, just a couple things. Just to show you the way people think under pressure. You know what I mean? It just don't make sense. All right. Check out this clip of this woman with the, at the gas pump. So she got her groceries back there with the gas, gas leaking all over the place. Trunk going to be smelling like gas. If this bitch happened to be smoking a cigarette <laughs> or somebody, <laughs> she, she done, man. She done. You know what I mean? Like people just don't think, just go grab a gas can and fill it up. They're available. Go to Ace Hardware. Go to Hobby Lobby. Go in your gas station. They are there. Like, I don't get people, bro. It ain't that deep, man. Damn. So, she had gas leaking out the bag. She had to double bag it. Like, it's just at the point where it's like, dude, what are you doing? Now, remember when the pandemic started? Motherfuckers buying toilet paper like crazy. You see all this? I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't understand the logic of these people, man. 
Like, why toilet paper? I don't get it. But whatever. But that's just how people Jake be thinking. People be thinking, man. All right, this is Luke 23 and 31. It says, for if they do these things in a green tree, what shall they do? What shall be done in the dry? So when they react to certain things like this, when things are green, when things are all dried up, when things are all gone, when those shelves are completely empty and there's no restock, all right, in anything, when there's violence all over the place, when there's suffering everywhere, when there's no significant hope, people are going to crack. And that hasn't even happened yet. But we see the, just an inkling of what it could look like on based off the way people react. See, this is what the elites do. They put things out there to see how you react. So when they actually do try to fulfill their uh, their plans and their agenda, they know how to, you know, say, approach you with uh, the information, all right, and their propaganda and things of that nature. They know what to do, all right? So right now, we in a green tree, but in the dry, it's going to get so much worse, all right? So much worse. This is Matthew 24 and 12. It says, and because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold, and the and the iniquity iniquity shall abound, and it's going to get worse and worse and worse. So right now you're going to see you see how people were when when they, when they were looking for that toilet paper. I seen the video. People were fighting over toilet paper. How much more when there's no food, man? No food. Hell, people are going crazy right now because they have a uh, a shortage of um, chicken wings, man. So niggas can't go to their chicken spot right now and get that, that 10 piece for for fucking like ten ninety nine now. Get the fries, the bread, coleslaw for ten ninety nine, ten wings, barbecue. Can't do that no more. Now that motherfucker like seventeen dollars at certain places. It's for real. My man's called me and told me. <laughs> Straight up. So hey man, hey, things are gonna get worse, man. But we see how people are gonna react. So with that, all praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shine.